another video on this youtube channel so i'm just walking somewhere on the road and i'm actually recording this video because i want to withdraw 20 dollars from binance so if you are someone who is finding it difficult to withdraw money from binance or withdraw your cryptocurrency into your mo mobile money wallet this particular video is going to help you so without wasting any time let's get started so now if you come on your home page or if you have money in your binance wallet you will be seeing it here so one thing you have to think about is to make sure that your money is in your funding wallet if not you can withdraw from momo so how do you know that your money is in your funding wallet you come here and tap on wallet so if i tap on wallet on my funding wallet i have 21 dollars so i want to withdraw 20 dollars so i will go back to the home page and tap on p2p so i'll tap on p2p so if i tap on p2p the next thing to do is to come here and tap on sell but one thing i want you guys to know is that when i bought um, this asset one dollar was equal to what 12 cds 20 uh, 12 cds 50 pesos but now as at the time i'm coming to withdraw i am now coming to sell it for 13 cds 31 cent so it means i've made like one ghana cds on it so basically if you are someone who has a usdt automatically you'll be making profit it's not compulsory to trade features or spots even if you have the asset in your account automatically you'll be making some profit on it so this is a typical example so this video is actually to tell you that not to actually show you how to withdraw you know money from your wallet from your wallet but if you're a beginner let's continue with this video so what i'll do is to come here and tap on sell but one thing you must consider if you're a complete beginner is that first of all look at how much you have in your account so right now i have what twenty dollars so twenty dollars i can sell this guy here kelvin this kelvin guy is buying sorry is selling for sorry is buying from 100 ghana cities to what 180 80 ghana cities so meaning i can sell to him but because his money will not be up to my budget like i have to skip him and if i come here to this guy right here called bitpass his own is also for from 4000 to 250 ghana city uh, 50000 which means i can't sell to him to because his budget is above me so i have to look for someone that matches my budget so here i've seen that fear women is actually in my budget because he's buying from 100 ghana cities to 1300 so meaning he can buy my 20 dollar he can buy my 20 dollar asset then if you come here to you see that they are accepting mtm mobile money so if he's not accepting mobile mtm mobile money me personally i can't sell to him because my payment method is what mtm mobile money so basically what i'll do is to tap here tap on the sell so if i tap on the sell i'll put here 20 dollars so 20 dollars will be equal to 266 ghana cities charlie the dollar is going on <laughs> so now what i'll do is to come here and put in my payment method so i'll put in my payment method here and come here and tap on sell so if i tap on sell that's all so i'll just wait for the guy mm -hmm by name fear women to send me the money so if you send me the money into the mobile money wallet i'll come here and continue uh we'll finish the transaction here so let me give him some time and see okay sometimes if you see that it's getting too late or it's not responding and all that you can message him you can come here and tap on message and um uh, maybe say something like hi um 
waiting for payment so within some time i believe you attend to me because if you come to the back here they said uh for him he'll pay you in five minutes time so that's what i'm waiting for so guys after four minutes he sent me the money so let me go to my message and check if the money is there so here we go so the money is actually in there so you can see 266 ghana cities so let me go back so the next thing i'll do is to come here and tap on payment receive because i've received the money so you have to pay attention to this place because here if you did not receive the full payment you can let binance know that you did not receive the full payment but if you receive the full payment you can also let them know so see the first one they said i have not received payment from the buyer then the next one to the as they said i have verified that the payment of 266 ghana cities has been received from nathaniel ofori entry so i've received the payment so i'll tap here and agree on that and come here and tap on what confirm release okay so the next thing to do is to just go and input my verification code because they'll send a verification code to my email account and go back to binance and put in the code there and here will confirm that i have received the money so from here if there is any cheating like maybe the person did not send me the money but i've already clicked all these things that i've received the money that will be all so you have to make sure that you check your accounts to ensure that you have the money in your mobile money wallet so guys basically this is how you can withdraw money into your mobile money wallet if you're someone who is trading cryptocurrency on binance i believe this video has been helpful guys be sure to subscribe and turn on the notification bell for more helpful videos anytime i get to the studio i'll bring you another helpful video